I'd like to talk about our micro range of digging and shoveling appliances. So it gives me the opportunity to, to settle um, an often heard argument. What's the difference between uh, shovels? Why, why a, round neck, a round face shovel and a square face shovel? Well, the square face shovels are for shoveling, i.e. lifting material from one place to another, and the round face, much like a spade, are for digging. Okay, so digging, shoveling. What an, I mean, it's just an immense idea. Really, really clever. The, the, the shovel has got so many applications. You will see some of them in a moment on this video. Simply getting stuff out of small bags of sand and cement is just so much easier with one of these. Out of um, ton bags even. Shoveling in, in tight corners in, in trenches or whatever when you're shoveling the bottom of a trench. When you're digging the sides of a trench, you would use a micro shovel because there's room to move it. When you're metal detecting, when you're doing gardening, when the kids are in the garden, we've got micro forks, fantastic. They, you know, everybody can use these, they're easy to use. You, know, you haven't got an enormous amount of weight on the end of your shovel, and it seems like you're not doing so much, but you're doing twice as much because you can last twice as long. Um, one step up from the micro shovel is the mini shovel. This is the one that we would probably suggest for um, metal detecting or whatever it's longer it gives you a longer reach you don't have to stoop down with it when you're metal detecting um, and, and if anybody who's been metal detecting it knows off it goes uh, it goes off quite often for the wrong reasons so uh, bending down less is a great idea so that's the uh, that's the mini shovel all in all a really great range from roughneck they might be small they might look like playthings, but these are professional quality solid solid items so I'm really, really pleased that I was given the opportunity to demonstrate them. Why not keep a micro shovel in the boot of the car to get you out of trouble in the winter?